Hello everyone and welcome to Knowledge and Quiz Universe. Our today's quiz is on the World Heritage Sites of India Part 2. Uh, as I told you, there are 42 World Heritage Sites in India and covering all of them would be a difficult task. So I have divided these quiz in multiple parts and this is the Part 2 of the World Heritage Sites of India. So let us begin with the questions. The walled city of Ahmedabad was founded by Shahi Ahmed Khan, Sultan Ahmed Shah, Nadir Shah, or Sarfaraz Ahmed. The correct answer is Sultan Ahmed Shah. Please note the name Ahmedabad, Ahmed, right? So Sultan Ahmed Shah was the founder of the walled city of Ahmedabad. The walled city of Ahmedabad was established in the year 1411, 1524, 1433 or 1568. The correct answer is 1411. The walled city of Ahmedabad was founded by Sultan Ahmed Shah in the 15th century. That is 1411 was the year. The walled city of Ahmedabad is located on the banks of which river? Saraswati, Sabarmati, Godavari or Narmada? Sabarmati. We know that the Sabarmati flows through Ahmedabad, right? So Sabarmati was the uh, river on the banks of which walled city of Ahmedabad is located. The Champaner Pavgad Archaeological Park is in which state? Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh, Gujarat or Uttar Pradesh? The correct answer is Gujarat. The historical city of Champaner was founded by which dynasty? Solanki, Godhara, Chavala or Pradyota. The correct answer is Chavala. Uh, the king Vanraj Chavala, who was the prominent king of Chavala dynasty, established the historical city of Champaner in 8th century. So please note this. I have uh, also uh, highlighted the keywords here. Vanraj Chavra, prominent king of Chavra dynasty, established the, the historical city of Champaner in the 8th century. Okay. Next, go, let, let's go to the next question. The Muslim emperor Mahmud Begara captured Pavgar in which century? 9th century? 11th century, 13th century or 15th century. The correct answer is 15th century. The great music maestro of 16th century, Beju Bhavra, whose real name was Bejnath Mishra, belonged to Pavgar, Champaner, Ahmedabad or Vadodara. The correct answer is Champaner. Champaner is popular because Baiju Bhavra, Bhajanath Mishra belonged to Champaner. He was the great music maestro of 16th century and he was Tansen's contemporary rival. Right? And he belonged to Champaner. Uh, you can have questions about the places and uh, some prominent people who belong to those places. Right? Um, you can get questions on that also. So please remember, Baiju Bhavra belonged to Champaner. Champaner was popular because of this great music maestro also. Let's go to the next question. The Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj Terminus is in which city? Jalgaon, 
मुंबई औरंगाबाद और पुणे द करेक्ट आंसर इज मुंबई द छत्रपति शिवाजी महाराज टर्मिनस वॉज अर्लियर नोन एज अलिजाबेथ टर्मिनस विक्टोरिया टर्मिनस लैंगफोर्ड स्टेशन और कनिंगम जंक्शन द करेक्ट आंसर इज विक्टोरिया टर्मिनस छत्रपति शिवाजी महाराज टर्मिनस वॉज ऑल्सो नोन एज विक्टोरिया टर्मिनस द छत्रपति शिवाजी महाराज टर्मिनस वॉज डिजाइन बाय द ब्रिटिश आर्किटेक्ट हुज नेम वॉज एडविन ल्यूटिन्स नॉर्मन फॉस्टर जॉर्ज विटेट और फ्रेडरिक विलियम स्टीवेंस द करेक्ट आंसर इज फ्रेडरिक विलियम स्टीवेंस द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ द छत्रपति शिवाजी महाराज टर्मिनस कंप्लीटेड इन द इयर एटीन एटी सेवन सेवनटीन एटी एट एटीन सेवेंटी एट और सेवनटीन सिक्सटी थ्री The correct answer is 1887. The construction got over in the year 1887, marking 50 years of Queen Victoria's rule, and that is why the terminus was also earlier named as Victoria Terminus. So you have to remember that in 1887, 50 years of Queen Victoria's rule uh, were completed, and to mark that, Victoria Terminus was constructed. The Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj Terminus is built in which architectural style? That is another important question. It is constructed in Neolithic architecture style, Roman architecture, Gothic architecture, or Egyptian architecture. Which architectural style does the architecture of Chhatrapati Maharaj Shivaji Maharaj Terminus is following? The correct answer is Gothic architecture. The Italian Gothic architecture was what this particular structure was inspired by. The next architecture, uh, the next archaeological uh, site, or the World Heritage site that we are going to talk about is Bhim Betka, the rock shelters of Bhim Betka. So let us go to the question. The rock shelters of Bhim Betka are found in which state? Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh, Gujarat, or Bihar? <coughs> the correct answer is Madhya Pradesh. It is located in the Raisen district of the Indian state of Madhya Pradesh, which is about 45 kilometers southeast of. the capital of madhya pradesh bhopal right so the rock shelters of bhim betka are located in the state of madhya pradesh the bhim betka rock shelters are famous for cave paintings lakes hill stations or mining This place is famous for cave paintings. The cave paintings that provide the evidence of human civilization during 8000 BC, which is approximately 10000 years ago. <coughs> right? So, looking at these cave paintings, we can see that uh, there was civilization, there was human civilization existing 10000 years ago. The Bhim Betka rock shelters are in the foothills of Satpura Range, Vindhyan Mountains, Nilgiri Mountains, or Balaghat Range. These are located in the foothills of Vindhyan Mountains. The rock shelters of Bhim Betka are in the foothills of Vindhyan Mountains, on the southern edge of Central Indian Plateau. 
little more about bhimbetka rock shelters the name bhimbetka is bhima's resting place or bhima's baithak right so bhima the second brother of the five pandavas of mahabharata his seat or lounge so according to the native belief during the exile of pandavas bhima during his exile used to rest here to interact with the locals and hence the name came as bhim baithaka or bhim baithak when was it discovered the first archaeologist to visit a few caves it was v s vakankar and he visited the area with a team of archaeologists and reported several prehistoric rock shelters in the year 1957 please remember all the highlighted <coughs> keywords uh, that is uh, v s vakankar was the first archaeologist to visit there in the year 1957 and the name bhimbetka came because the locals say that uh, bhima it was uh, he used to sit here or he used to rest here also these play paintings can be classified into seven different periods upper paleolithic mesolithic chalcolithic early historic and medieval right so these are some more keywords that uh, or some more points that you must remember you may get questions out of this let's go to the next question and before that if you think that you are getting to learn something please consider to subscribe to this channel let's go to the next question the sachi stupa is located in which indian state gujarat madhya pradesh rajasthan or chatisgarh The correct answer is Madhya Pradesh on a hilltop of Sachi town in Raisen district of the state of Madhya Pradesh if you remember the previous uh, world heritage site Bhimbetka rock shelters of Bhimbetka that was uh, that is also located in Raisen district of Madhya Pradesh and even Sachi stupa is located in Raisen district of Madhya Pradesh please remember these two points The Sachi Stupa signifies which religion? Hinduism, Jainism, Buddhism or Sikhism? The correct answer is Buddhism. Stupa is a very important part of Buddhist culture or Buddhist religion. So wherever there is any stupa it is related to Buddhism. the great stupa sachi stupa is also called the great stupa the great stupa was originally commissioned by the mauryan empire uh, emperor chandragupta ashoka bindusara or devavarma the correct answer is ashoka ashoka was the mauryan emperor who commissioned the great stupa the sachi stupa when was the sachi stupa commissioned in 3rd century bc 4th century bc 5th century bc or 6th century bc the correct answer is 3rd century bc the question about sanchi stupa and who commissioned it has been asked in previous question papers and the question was the oldest stone structure commissioned by the mauryan emperor ashoka is sanchi stupa peshawar stupa amravati stupa or nagarjuna konda stupa the answer you would be knowing by now the correct answer is sachi stupa so this question i wanted to take it up because this is how it was asked in previous year question papers and with this we have to the end of this quiz i hope you got to learn something please consider to subscribe to this channel for more such content thank you for watching see you again